It's the national sport of Ireland, and this fast-paced, high-scoring sport combines the endurance of soccer and the physicality of lacrosse. And I had a lesson in the sport, and it was pretty fun. Take a look. Jab lifts, guys. Jab lifts. Curling is a sport that dates back like 3,000 years. While this sport is millennia old, it has an even cooler tie to St. Louis. The 1904 Olympics that were here in St. Louis um, was, I believe, the first and only time that hurling has been in the Olympics. Yeah. Yeah, um, yeah. So that's pretty special that that the only time it ever happened was here in St. Louis, you know. Um, and it's kind of cool. We have a handful of people that are over here from Ireland and kind of came oh, over here, had no idea that the sport even existed in the United States, you know? And then they're like, oh my gosh, oh, it's here, you know? Um, so it's, it's really neat, it's cool. But what is Irish hurling exactly? This is a hurley and this is um, a slitter, so, um, or a ball. And it's a little bit smaller than a baseball. The objective is, uh, to get the ball in the goal for three points or over the bar for one point. It's a sport that has set the tone for many that have come after it. It's probably closest to hockey, um, but it plays with so many different things. It's got the you know hand-eye coordination and stick handling of hockey, um, hand-eye coordination of baseball, um, you know, kind of that, that running burst of speed that you might have in soccer. And it's also really physical too. You can check people like you do in football too. So it's very physical. So it brings a lot of things from different sports into one sport. One of the many sports played by the St. Louis Gaelic Athletic Club. The St. Louis Gaelic Athletic Club, we were founded in 2003. Um, so we're in our 19th year right now. We're coming up on our 20th. Um, over the kind of over the past uh, 19 years that we've been doing it, it kind of started off with hurling, um, which is kind of the main sport of the club, um, mostly a men's sport. Get some strikes um, to the and hand. then we started adding Gaelic football to it, which is very similar. Essentially, you just play with a different <laughs> ball. And then uh, Camogie joined. We're probably 10 years in now, about with Camogie. Yeah, yeah. Camogie is the women's version of hurling. Um, extremely stuff, similar. Guys. Think of like the difference between like baseball and softball. Um, so we've had all those sports going for um, these past 19 years. And this club plans on being here for the long haul because for some, its impact has been life changing. I joined right. this club when I was 15 years old. Uh, I was the youngest one out on the pitch. I had to have my mom sign my waiver to come play. Uh, and all of these guys and all of these women really just like took me under their wing and it just became this like family for me, you know? Um, and so I am in my ninth year playing now, I think, and I just have never really been able to leave because everyone here is just so positive. It's such a fun group. Um, we all hang out outside of the sport itself, you know, so some of my closest friendships that I've ever had I've built here. You know, we're really looking for, um, we want to expand the sport, you know, kind of promote it um, as part of like, you know, the Irish heritage, but also um, for St. Louis as well. Um, we think that once you get in the club, you meet a lot of the players, it's so much fun, and um, yeah, we just, we just have a great time. So yeah, we're just, we're just recruiting as many people as possible. Bring that stick over, guys. Have we piqued your interest? Join the club and preserve Irish history and heritage with the St. Louis Gaelic Athletic Club. In Forest Park, Chelsea Haynes, Studio STL. It's Irish hurling, Gaelic football, and camogie. To learn more about all the St. Louis Gaelic Athletic Club does, you can visit their website. It's stlgac.com, or you can show them some love on Facebook and on Instagram. Their handles are right there on the screen. And happy St. Patty's Day to that organization who is keeping the history and heritage of Gaelic sports alive. Don't go anywhere, St. Louis. We'll have a lot more of the show in just a couple of minutes.